After creating a linear sketch pattern, it is not readily apparent how you can go back to readjust the parameters and also how to fully define the sketch. In this video, I will show you how. When creating a sketch pattern, it is always a good practice to ensure that the dimension spacing and the display instance count checkboxes are checked. This will allow you to edit these two parameters on the fly. If you do want to get back into the Linear Pattern Property Manager, just right-click on any sketch entity and look out for Edit Linear Pattern. Judging by the blue entities, the Linear Pattern is undefined. This is the case even though the seed feature has been centered on the origin and the spacing has already been defined. If I pick on an entity and try to drag it in space, you will see that the whole pattern rotates while maintaining that spacing. If you look between the seed rectangle and its first copy, you will notice that there is a construction line joining the two entities. This construction line was automatically created when the dimension spacing checkbox was checked. In order to fully define this sketch, just pick on that construction line and give it a horizontal constraint. 